Hello, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Scan Diagnostics. Say this is the CBCT of the patient which you had requested. The area of interest is the lower right six and the lower right seven, which is edentulous for implant placement. On the panoramic view, you can see that we've got adequate bone. On the lower left hand quadrant, which is quadrant number three, we can very clearly show you that the ridge width here is approximately 7.1 millimeters and the ridge uh, length here is 11.6 millimeters. Here, a implant placement is definitely possible because the uh, bone quality here is D2. Moving to the left hand side, the right hand side, my apologies. This is where the tip of the crest of the ridge is 4 millimeters, but if we go slightly deeper, we've got 7 millimeters of ridge width with approximately 16 millimeters of height. Now, the Im we have placed two implants for our doctor so that they can see. There we go. These are neobiotic implants which are placed center of the ridge and these are prosthetically driven implants which if placed can provide adequate bone support and tooth support um, for the prosthesis. Now these implants we've created a uh, panel, the implant planning report as well. The implant on the right will need to be placed slightly deeper uh, if uh, adequate bone on the buccal and lingual aspect is required. Both areas have the to quality of the bone and hence implant placement is definitely possible. On the axial view, we'll show you that both the implants are placed in the center of the ridge. The ridge on the right hand side is thinner than the ridge on the left hand side, but if placed in the center, it will have adequate bone support. Thank you very much.